Uh, I've got a macro-friendly homemade pizza. This is a taco mac and cheese. Taco mac and cheese pasta crust. Mm-hmm, yep. Topped with mozzarella cheese, pepperoni, and sausage. This is gonna be a doozy. I don't have my salad. I don't have my hot sauce. I don't have any of my normal pizza fixings. Just this, low calorie, macro friendly, something to jump start my, my work week tomorrow and Friday. Only two days, only two days though. So you know I'm happy about that. That freaking looks good. It does, you could have a bite, I'll share. Khaki's looking pissed, no, she's not no. pissed. I didn't do nothing, I didn't I do nothing. Feel, I don't feel well. I told her if she wants just to go to sleep and skip dinner. And we'll have the Jamie show tonight, but she's a trooper. She wants to eat her food and uh, try. go from there. She might bounce during the stream, though. She might. All depends on if her food is that good, but she's like, oh, my God, I got to get a taste. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. Just um, Play it by ear. I just have some chicken strips, mashed potatoes, and some green beans. Kept it simple. Oh, no. Uh-oh. Shit. All right. Well, it looks like I'm not gonna it. I'm not gonna pick it up like a pizza slice. It kind of fell apart. I guess because it's been dumped like the last two hours. Oh yeah, it's been sitting. It's good though. It's good. It's good. It's good. All right. I gotta pick it up somehow. It's gonna fall apart. You think so? No, I got I, I picked it up before. I gotta get a spatula. Oh jeez. Sorry guys. Alright. Is the it. pasta crunchy? Yeah, you just get a crunch? It is no crust. I mean there's no dough. I just don't want to stick to the tin foil. Huh? Yeah, it's fucking good though. What do you think? Mm. I think so. Well, the cheese stuck to the fucking tin foil because I had to heat it up. Come to daddy. How many calories is that? Uh, like 2,000, 2,100. But I could make it, I could have made it lower calorie. Like I didn't need all this extra cheese. I did not, fucking it's falling apart. Just eat it. I'm just gonna eat it, I'm gonna pick it up. Like mini pizza slices. Would anybody try this? Would anybody do a pasta as the crust? Like, Haggy likes crunchy noodles. I'm not the I biggest fan of crunchy noodles. noodles, but I figured this, this might work, and it, it did. It fucking did. I just can't pick it up. I think it's because I, I topped it very heavy with cheese and pepperoni yeah, and you sausage. you put a lot of stuff on there. It's definitely a fully loaded slice. Yeah, but you know what? I don't taste the taco. I don't taste the taco, the taco mac and cheese. No. I just taste pizza. It's good though. Okay. Like out of a one to ten, I would give this a seven. Seven no, and a half. I would say eight. That other macro friendly pizza that I made, I think it was on Monday, doesn't hold a candle. This I'm actually enjoying every bite. Yeah, these are crunchy noodles. Not dough. Not dough. I wanted to do originally chicken and, and rice cakes tonight. That's something I actually wanted to do. And then I'm like, the pizza diet, the pizza diet, the pizza diet. Maybe I'll do, but I had guacamole I was going to do. And I'm like, I just want sausage and pepperoni. Sometimes you crave certain things and you can't get out of that. So that's what I did. I'm going to go back to work tomorrow. You'd think I'd be pissed off, but... You're happy to go work. I'm not happy. I'm happy to go out and do something. Rather than, you know, be stuck at home 
and not really being very active. That's the one thing I do miss. I miss being active. Which I guess is a good thing. But I killed it with strength training this week. I mean, I really busted my ass doing it. Lowered my cardio by a lot. I didn't even do cardio today, just strength training. Took the kids to a sprinkler park. You're fasting bastard. Hey, Pete. I just, they didn't want to leave, but I don't blame them. They were having fun. Now, how long were we there? We were at the sprinkler park for probably about what? About Half an hour. Isabella made a friend. Yeah, it was very cute. What's up, dork? Hey, Chrissy. Hey, Chrissy. Chrissy, you know what? We could have picked. We could, we could have crossed paths yesterday. Could have. And not even known it. What train were you on? What train were you on for the Met game? Like what time? We were on the. What time did we get on the train? We got on the train at what? Four. Four, four something. Team. On the Ron Conkama line, the seven line. No. Mm -mm. You know, what's a seven line? That's a subway. Oh, okay. I was going to say, I saw your picture on Instagram. I'm like, oh, she's, maybe she, maybe we'll cross paths. Because I didn't know. We knew there was a Met game, but there was also Kiss. Kiss was in town, I guess. And then there was a 50 Cent thing going on at the Garden. Oh, yeah, that's right. So I'm, I'm thinking, like, where was Kiss then? Everybody had Kiss shirts on. You were at, at six. Where the hell else is Kiss going to play in New York City, other than the Garden? Pete. Yeah, I don't know. I made a giant pizza slice out of pasta. Very good. Very good. I know you you just recently made a, a giant pizza slice. I'm going to... Oh, the Barclay Center. Barclay Oh, yeah, I guess you can. Barclay Center is... How far is the, I've never been to the Barclays Center, so no, is that neither. is that far from MSG or? I would have thought Fifty Cent would be at the Barclays Center and Kiss would be at the Garden. But I don't know. All they do know is the train was fucking packed. Yeah. And the train ride there was okay, but the train ride home fucking sucked. Khaki's got chicken, mashed potatoes, and green beans. Yeah. Khaki's under the weather tonight. She, out of what time was it around? Like 10:30. She's like, I'm just gonna go lay down. I'm not feeling good. No, at first it was like nine something. Was it nine something? Mm -hmm. And I got all my shit done while she was in the shower, and like I weighed everything out by myself. I, I made everything by myself. I put the video together. Everything was done. She's falling asleep on the counter. I'm like, go to sleep. You want to skip tonight? Skip tonight. She said, oh, no, I'm just going to go lay down. I never just go lay down. You know, I never do that. Why? No, she, no, this is like one of the first times. I felt, I know how Khaki felt. You know, um, you know, it, it, this is how I was around Christmas time with, with FedEx. I was so worn out that my meal would be just about done. I would take a nap and Khaki would wake me up around midnight. Pasta pizza, explain how. Okay, I'll tell you how. I did a couple servings of pasta. Okay, I added um, refried beans and cheese. And then I added some coconut flour. I mixed it all together. Hi, Tan. Hey, Tan. I mixed it all together. And then I put it on a, uh, a baking sheet. I meshed it out with a spoon. It wasn't sticking, so I had to um, car uh, carve it, shape it with my hands. I baked it for about 25 minutes. Once it came out, I topped it with sauce, more cheese, pepperoni, and sausage. Put it back in the oven for probably about an hour with the oven off. And it's not not bad at all. Yeah, Chrissy, no, this is this is really good. I mean, it's not it's not real pizza, it's not real dough, but it's not far from the from the real thing either, right? No. Like you wouldn't even. I'll show you a close up. You can see the noodles. You wouldn't even think this was pasta. 
I mean, this could get away for passing as a doe. This really could. Now, the, the question is, do I continue to do this? I mean, was it a pain in the ass? Eh, depends on, what kind of, depends on what kind of pizza I want to make. I mean, I can't, I don't want to use refried beans every time for the glue. You wouldn't need to. I wouldn't need to, but it helped. It definitely helped. This almost tastes like an Elio pizza. No. Thank you, Way Pete. Than Elio's. It has a similar taste than Elio's pizza, though. Favorite all time meal as a kid that my mom made? Uh, my mom used to make, and I, I say used to because my taste buds have changed. I don't like, I don't like oil and all that stuff. Like, I don't like stuff deep fried, pretty much. Um, and my mom made the best chicken cutlets. She would put melted, like a cheese sauce on it, not Tostitos. She would just take up straight up deli slices, put it in the microwave with a little bit of milk, make a cheese sauce, and then dump it over there. She would make chicken cutlets and mashed potatoes. That's probably my favorite that she made homemade. Off the top of my head. You have a chicken in the oven. Shocker. Shocker. <laughs> Not really. It's, I mean, I, I would be shocked just because you went back to carbs, Pete. Are you, are you still doing the carbs or do you like, um, I'm not... I'm not feeling the carbs right now. Or you like carb cycling. I can't wait to see what Ben writes for me tomorrow. Jamie, are you fucking kidding me? He wasn't happy this morning. <laughs> he wasn't happy this morning. Not a happy camper. But my McDonald's last night. Yeah, well. Can't make everybody happy all of the time. Ben, I know you're looking out for me, so it's all good. I do, but you shouldn't be able to say anything bad about this. This is a fucking macro-friendly, low-calorie, pretty much hit all my fucking macros and micros. Under my fat, under my cholesterol, over my protein, way under my carbs. This is a healthy meal. Healthy. Do you have anything you want to say, Kevin? Are you doing barbecue sauce? How's that? I kind of want to try it, but I'm not going to. Uh -huh. No. It's just chicken and barbecue sauce. Nothing but, special. You think I should get Parmesan cheese? Ever almost beat a coworker? Had it? Have I ever? I've gotten some mm. fights with coworkers. Yeah. Like I've fist fights. I've thought about doing it. I've gotten into a fist fight with a coworker before. To a few people at my job. Did I win? No, but I didn't lose. It was one of those carbs once or twice a week. I have more weight to lose before I can do more. My blood sugar goes up if I do more than that. Okay. Oh, yeah. Take it by take it slow then. Take it by slow. I think my fucking body would go into shock if I just cut out carbs. Uh, I think so too. But here, here's a. You might laugh at this. I filed a bunch of people on keto today. <laughs> I filed, like, I'm not even joking, like maybe 10 keto accounts. Why? Because their shit looked good. And I'm starting to venture out and do different meals. And any, any good looking meal, is, is, if it's a good idea, I'm going to fucking try it. I am going to try it. I saw one pizza that had a chicken crust. Chicken crust, but it seemed like a pain in the ass. He would die without cookies, Pete. Well, here's the thing. You guys know what I like to enjoy in the weekends. Now, during the week, I was doing a protein bar. But considering I don't need the protein bar, and I wanted to go a little bit lower in calorie, I have cookies, but they're cookie thins. Hey, city. Hey, city. It is what a pain in the ass. Hey, Nisbo. It is a pain in the ass. Huh? I said, hey, Nisbo. Hey, what's up? I think I need sauce, though. Well, it's not dry. It's not dry, but for, like, more flavor, I think I should. 
when you were on keto, I haven't placed yet is in sausage crust. Well, I'm whole box. <clears throat> making a whole box of spaghetti meal. It's a they great feeling, AJ. AJ, it's a great feeling. And that's the funny thing, like, you think of like your calories for the meal, like holy shit, this meal is fourteen hundred calories or whatever. That's fucking low. If you're a dude, that's low. Yeah. Like I looked at this meal. This meal's like two thousand calories. It's fucking low for me. Well, doesn't mean you are a keto and can't have a cookie. Oh no, yeah, you're right, Lacey. I wouldn't. Yeah. I wouldn't give up if I do a keto meal. Nothing stopping my ass from eating cookies. Hey, you lie. How are you tonight? Hello, you lie. Guys, I know today. I know we're like we're we're like in the middle of the work week, but I've been off. So today's like my Sunday. No beer tonight. I'm on time. We're on time. I got everything ready for work tomorrow except my work clothes. Which, did you do laundry? Did you do my work clothes? Of course, I did the I wasn't on sure. Sunday. I was not sure. Mm, this is so good. Uh, so good. I do miss my salad, though. I wonder what's the biggest pizza slice I can make. Be able to pick it up, dangle it in front of the camera, without it getting stuck to the baking sheet or pulling apart. That's what I'm wondering. Parts Keto trick my eating time. disorder. So your therapist and I made a mutual decision to stop and practice init yeah, intuitive and now back to tracking macros loosely. Good for you, Sidney. It's genius. It's not my idea. This was somebody else's. Well, not well. This is my idea, but I got the pasta idea as a crust from somebody else. And I did mine a lot different. I added different things because I just didn't see how it would work the other person's way. But I do remember you, Nisbo, and that's great. Nisbo's lost 100 pounds so far. Great job, this though. That's awesome. I tell you, I was 420 pounds last August. Now I'm at 315. That's fucking great. That's great. Are you, are you still losing weight, you know, consistently? You know, slow and steady? That's great. 100 pounds, that's fucking awesome. Back to basics, but I think I mentioned this the other night about back to basics. Yeah, you probably did, City, but I've been fucked up all week. <laughs> so I probably don't remember. Your sweets, that's only when it's then. That's great that you're back to tracking. Now, uh, City, how long were you doing keto for? You still eat all your cookies. And that's not a bad thing. You should eat all your cookies. Slow and steady. That's, listen. A lot of a lot of people don't want to do the slow and steady thing. They just want to see the results fast. Yeah, they just want like to snap their fingers and like. And I'm the same way. I want my body to be different too. But one thing I did notice because I'm not where I want to be with my transformation, right? One thing I did notice is when I first started losing the initial 75 pounds, that shit happened in a blink of an eye, right? And there are things that I didn't document because it happened so quick. I wasn't expecting it to happen that quick. Now that it's going so slow, I'm taking every picture, every video. I've got tons of shit once I do get what my body wants to do for transformation picks and side-by-sides. It's just you, you want to enjoy the ride even though you're, you still you know have work to do. Like when we were in the city last night, we took a picture with Blake and, uh, and Eric. Yeah. And the one picture that I took with Blake, the shirt that I had on, I was also drinking beer all day long for the most part, so I got, I was bloated. But I look like I'm pregnant. Did you notice that picture? No. Mm -hmm. Lacey, 23 pounds is great. Don't say only 23 pounds. I lost 23 pounds. That's awesome. But you're throwing up, if you're eating over 10 carbs. 10 net carbs you were throwing up? I look great pics. You took great pics last night? Thank you, Lacey. Yeah, it was a fun night. Yes, you're awesome. That they are, Pete. They are very cool people. 
Very cool people. I mean, chances of Eric and his beautiful girlfriend coming back to New York City anytime soon. Oh, he's next food tour. And plus the shitty fucking traveling he's having right now. <laughs> yeah, he's still in New York. He's stuck. In he's not in New York. Yes, he is. No, he's not. Yes, he is. No. I watched his live. He's, no, he's not. He's, I don't think he's in New York. He's stuck at JFK. Is for he? four hours. They went to go get drinks, and then he went live. Oh. He's stuck in New York. Oh, I know that. But that man is in an airport still. You followed them forever? Yeah, they're cool people. They're great people. They really are. I kind of want to do a food challenge, but at the same time... I don't do good at eating, like, on a time limit. Like, I know you said you wanted to do that burger thing, and I did too. But can you imagine how he's feeling today? Oh, I want to. Like, I know how I was feeling eating just McDonald's last night. And my McDonald's without my sweets was like 3,600 calories, something like that. Then no, I had two no burgers. I did. Hey, Pisces. Hey, Pisces. <clears throat> Younger than last year. Can you do a close up of the food? Uh, Nisbo, khaki or me? You want my? I'll do, I guess we'll do. Yeah, mine's almost gone. You think we look younger? Well, thank you. He said you. You look younger than I you did last younger? year. Thank you. What about me? Do I look younger? Pisces, how are you tonight? I gotta get a napkin. I gotta get a napkin. You need any? Mm-hmm. And they have great, great chemistry. Food. They have a channel together? They have a YouTube channel. What do they do? What is the... It's not eating, I'm guessing, right? I'm not sure. I didn't look at it. <clears throat> I subscribed to Eric's YouTube channel, but I didn't know he had a... Instagram, you mean. All right, Pisces. Pisces, that gyro that I had last night was so freaking good. Oh, my God. I'm getting it again next time we go to the city. Oh, yeah. Absolutely. Maybe McDonald's, too, but... <laughs> Nisbo said your hair is longer. <laughs> Yeah, I'm growing the hair out. Growing the hair out real long. How long? I don't know. Right now when it's clean and it's like straight, it's like down to here. City gyros? I mean, I'm not New York City gyros, but city, the person I'm talking, gyros is your favorite food? Yeah, I don't have to have, I don't have a, like a real gyro very often and I should have took advantage of it last night and got more than one considering they were so damn cheap. Yeah, seriously. This <clears throat> uh, wants to know if you do a handstand. Can I do a handstand? Yes. I can walk on my hands too. You're getting it again tomorrow, Pisces. Don't blame you. What, can, food, can you walk on your ha- uh, hands? Listen, last year I was shitty at it, but I still was able to do it. I'm very good at it now. Five bucks, wow, amazing gift. Good. The price for a New York City gyro is so cheap. You get a hot dog and a soda for five bucks. Well. But you could get a freaking tasty ass gyro for six. Yeah, next time we go to the city, we're probably going to stay the night, though. And it's, we're probably looking at end of September, depending on how well we can budget our money. Yeah. But what should we do in the city? Obviously, we're going to get with Blake and Jenny and try to tell them work something out where they can meet us, go out for drinks, maybe eat East Village pizza. I definitely want to stay at the same hotel. The same hotel? Yeah. Because it was nice. It was a nice hotel. It was nice. We know what we're getting ourselves into. We know it's going to be a shabbat. Yeah, it's a big deal. City, uh... No problem. I have homemade pizza. The crust is made out of pasta. It's a pot. It's a mac and cheese taco. <clears throat> mac and cheese taco 
uh, pizza dough. It's not really pizza dough, that's fucking pasta. And then it's topped with pepperoni and sausage. Hey, Jimmy Jim. Hey, Jimmy. Very good. The chicken is done. Oh my god, it's pretty. <laughs> it's a pizza. You gonna post it, Pete? Jimmy Jim, how are you tonight? What's going on with you? How's Christina doing? She's sleeping tonight? They had spicy nuggets today for the first time. Really? They went to Wendy's. <clears throat> And they got one ten piece. I guess they pulled away and they tried the nuggets. And they well, went back. They did a Yui and ordered six ten pieces. Holy. With, with creamy sriracha. <laughs> Is that what you did last night? Mm -hmm. You'll take a pick? Okay. That's kind of spicy though, no? No. I couldn't do it. Number one, I wouldn't be able to eat just fucking 50 nuggets. Jimmy Jen, did you eat all, all, all uh, I'm guessing what, Christina had 10, you had 50? Or maybe Christina had 20, you had 40? Can you both do a flex? Really, Nisbo? I'm not, I'm not taking my, my sweater off. I'm freezing. Khaki's cold, but I will flex. I will flex. I don't mind. No one asks me to flex anymore. There used to be somebody in here that always used to. Kaki, do you mind? Is that okay? Twitch? Oh, I want these guns. <laughs> They're gonna be guns. They're gonna be loaded guns soon. Your sister's about to pop. Prigger's in the hospital about to deliver. Wow. Said he had an egg omelet with turkey. And monster cheese roll ups. Nice. Monster cheese, huh? Wrap. <clears throat> Wrap. Peppers dipped in ranch. Nice. You had 30 made veggies and mac and cheese for dinner. Was a big kid today. That sounds fun. Nisbo, are you laughing at the fact that my muscles aren't big? Or did I say something that made you chuckle? I'm curious. I'm curious. Listen, this new, what I'm doing now, my new sets of strength training. Is gonna fucking work. I'm already, I'm already feeling it, and I know that I'm gonna be doing the right, the right thing this time. I kind of feel embarrassed in the first hundred days because I was just like, ah, something's gonna happen. Nothing happened. Wow. Jimmy J said your name. Oh. Just yes or no. No other reply. Okay. For what? <clears throat> Jimmy Jim, Packy's under the weather. She yeah, I'm actually... not feeling good. I don't know if I'm going to sit here any, any longer. Did you get his text earlier? You look more cut, looking good. Did Thank you, Nisbo. She's going to look at her right now, Jimmy Jim. This no, is... I'm just looking at it now, Jimmy. I'm sorry. This is what I got left. You don't want to show me or no? I uh, guess. If you don't want to, I'm not going to force you to. I'm just letting you know. Yeah, poor baby. It hit her out of nowhere. It hit her out of nowhere. I don't, I'm not going to play that right now. Well. Mm -hmm. and it's not like we have anything going on in the background. I don't think he wanted this on here, though, is what I'm saying. Yeah, I'll watch it later. He's going to watch it after. Yeah. I'm getting, this is one of those meals where I'm feeling it and I'm going to be full. But I have a feeling I'm going to be hungry tomorrow. Yeah. Well, yeah, I mean, it's not... It's not like... <coughs> it's not crazy calorie fucking... That's good. You want another bite? No. I'm full. All right. It's spicy though. My nose keeps on running. I know to do giant Philly cheesesteaks one of these days. I, you know what? The last Philly cheesesteak I did 
the video I made for it <laughs> went up to like 15,000 views. Oh, really? That big one, yeah. It was the last one, and it was good, too. I don't know how many views is up to now, but I would imagine a lot more. I should have had cantaloupe. Your mom threw the cantaloupe out that was in the fridge. His mom had cantaloupe in there, and I told him, I was like, oh, you should go try a piece. No. And she just threw it out. I guess it went, it was going bad. Well, my, my, my here's Jimmy Jim, my process, my thought process for tonight was I wanted to initially stay about 10, uh, 1,000 calories. I was going to do either fruit or chicken and rice cakes. I don't know. After working out, I started to develop an appetite. Yeah, it's usually what happens. In my fuck fruit. Fuck rice cakes. I'm doing pizza. And then I started thinking, what kind of pizza am I do? Do I do pizza, English muffins? When you come to Chicago, I'll make you try a fresh, juicy piece of cantaloupe. Just one piece. I've had cantaloupe before. You have? I Remember you I got that did. bowl of fruit, that, that fruit bowl? When did you get a fruit bowl? Months ago. And I was dipping it all in ice cream. Mm, I don't remember. Yeah, there was a brief time where I was eating fruit. Like, twice a week. What don't you like about cantaloupe? I don't even remember what it tastes like. I don't even remember what it tastes like. So I would definitely try it again. Just cantaloupe because I had melon, honeydew. Oh, maybe it wasn't cantaloupe. Maybe it was honeydew I tried. Honeydew's green. Cantaloupe mm -hmm. is orange. No, it was a fruit platter. It had to be. I, de I definitely tried it. There was pineapple in there. You don't remember that time where I got that bowl from Stop and Shop? No. Mm -mm. I don't remember. I can't believe how. For a first time trying this, I'm super shocked. Super shocked. Yeah, because it came out so good. Yeah, if you want to go to sleep, you can go to sleep. You're already falling asleep. Yeah, I know. I'm not feeling well. I am not a big watermelon fan. Yeah, I'm not feeling well, Pisces. You gonna go to work tomorrow? Probably. Nisbo, tomorrow? I don't know. I won't know until tomorrow night. I'll have a bunch of ideas that will come through, you know, come to me tomorrow during the day. <laughs> and then it'll change. It'll change. And I won't know for sure. I know for damn sure I'll be around the same calories, but... Hi, Marissa. No worries. Listen, make you, you guys, and this goes for everybody. Make it in when you can. What the fuck is Pluto TV? Blind date? I don't know. Pluto TV? He's addicted to something. You know what, Jimmy Jim? I'm addicted to a show. It's not new, but it's The Rock Show, Ballers. I watched two episodes tonight once Kaki took a nap. As soon as she took a nap, I'm like, all right, what am I going to do? I went to HBO, and I saw, you know what, The Rock. Let's give it a shot. It's season four, so I have, to, I have a lot of catching up to do, but I'm probably going to watch the whole season. Kaki, have you ever seen Bowlers? No. The Rock Show? Very good. It's like the football version of Entourage. Yeah, it's good. Rock plays like the Ari, but not like the smart ass. They have Impact Wrestling. We'll see. I am, uh... Pete, you, maybe, maybe, listen, listen, no bullshit, 
She's she's sick. What? Calories you calories in the bank for the weekend? Nisbo, I've got no calories in the bank for the weekend. This week <laughs> was I I didn't I didn't work, so I didn't burn a lot of calories. So if anything, I've kind of borrowed some calories from tomorrow and Friday. But Yeah. There's ways of getting around it. What'd you say? I'm going. Going? Bye, guys. Have a good night. I got two more bites and I'm done too. Tan says she hopes you feel better. And then there was one. Pete, I don't know. She started feeling it before. Just felt nauseous. Starts next week. You like bowlers. Oh, you've seen it before. Yeah, it's probably a popular show. Rocks in it. I just don't watch TV, so I've always heard of it. And considering I love The Rock. Why not give it a show? A shot. I gotta catch up. I'm on season four. So... HBO doesn't have the original, the first season, the second season. So I'm just going to catch up on the fourth one. Alright. What time is it? How early am I cutting? No, no, it, 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 it took me a normal time. Feels like a lot quicker. Feels like a, a much quicker stream, right? We talked about vacation. What happened? What happened? I booked it the night. You booked what? I'm lost, Jimmy Jam. Help a brother out. Oh. Oh, the cruise, yeah. We were talking about that one night. You booked it like that night or the next day. That was funny. That was funny. All right. I'm going to bed. 37 minutes the stream was. All right. It was It was short. Cruise, you want to go on? Talking about me being a man of action. No. Yeah, no, Jimmy Jim, you're not a man of talk. You're definitely a man of action. Me? I am a man of talk. Good night, Pete. Good night, guys. I say a lot, and then I very rarely follow through with what I say. I, you know, what I want to do. And part of that is because I'm constantly wanting different things. But we will see you guys tomorrow. Hopefully, Kathy is better, and uh, we'll go from there. Have a great night, guys. Let's kill it for Thursday, huh? Have a great night's rest. I plan on it, Jimmy Jam. I'm going to be bitching and moaning in the morning. Save. Share. Good night, guys.